Hello. Um, yeah, so I'm going to play another request. This one was requested by Jason J, and it is Ralph on Alpha 2. And the reason he suggested I play this one is because this is the game that was eff effectively uh, plagiarized into Colin the Cleaner, which I played recently. Um, so this was released on a cover disc, or no, a, more of a online or digital magazine from about 1985. Uh, and this game was on that and it was obviously taken modded is the probably the, the generous term um and re-released as colin the cleaner bugs and all i think um so i'm gonna have a quick go at it i have have tried it it took a long time for me to get this to work uh, from the ts tzx file um i've now got a snapshot that i can load on the next um it's keyboard only as well it doesn't have the joystick controls um so uh, not that it makes too too much difference it's not that complicated but it does seem to have the bugs so i don't know how far we're going to get because we might get hit by those bugs but let's have a look um you'll see from the title screen here this looks very much like colin the cleaner looked you've got the same scrolling text and everything here um <clears throat> in fact even the way the authors are listed and the sounds listed and everything it's all very much the same um but we press to start the game with the s key that's a pretty cool effect I thought it was a bit different um, slow draw times because it's all written in basic uh, and because Retro Detective hasn't optimized it yet who knows he might <laughs> um, and the layout levels are a bit different and I think one thing that's interesting is uh, where you've got ladders and Colin the Cleaner you've got poles here um, and the, the teleporters and they make much more sense right <laughs> in space rather than just a janitor in a museum um, right, let's see how we do this time then. So it's Z left, X right, and M to do stuff. And uh, I'm not very really used to using the keyboard to play games, other than like classic Quake mouse and keyboard combos. But for platformers, it doesn't feel very natural to me. I can't, I can't remember what incantation I used. First time I played this, the um, exit didn't appear, and then I had one more go and it did appear, so I can't remember which way round I did it. Might have been this way around, but there we go. So we're through through it. That's that's good. <laughs> As you can see, we've still got time running down. It's air rather than just time. So uh, you've got air in your the spaceship that you're working in, or the planet you're in, or whatever it is. The plot line is that again makes a bit more sense than just sort of some random timer. Um, And again, I'm not, I'm not necessarily playing this to, to try and get too far. I just wanted to show the the inspiration, if you want to call it that, for Colin the Cleaner, having covered that recently. Um, and it's quite nice to see this sort of original one, which doesn't seem to have got too much coverage. Um, <clears throat> Rose Tinted Spectrum did mention it in his video on Colin the Cleaner. Again, if you haven't watched that yet, you really should. It's very good. Um, yeah, let's see how far we get. Time's running out pretty quick. I talk too much, I think. It's nice that all the um, level layouts are different as well, so if, even if you've played Colin the Cleaner a lot, maybe you'll get something out of this. But 
yeah, the sound effects, graphics mostly. Um, I think the main sprite looks a bit different, but the going down the the uh, poles or ladders looks the same as far as I can tell. Exactly the same sound effects. Which are actually not bad, I don't mind the sound effects at all. I guess some people might find them irritating, but I think they work. It might also be because, you know, I'm getting old and slightly deaf. Eh? There we go, we're going to get to four at least. <clears throat> uh -huh. What way should we go here then? Um... Slightly long way around, isn't it? I remember <clears throat> I haven't explained on this one but if you go step down you die you lose a life um, which is the same in Colin the Cleaner and I'm going to have to lose a life because I didn't really want to go up there <laughs> dang as if by uh, coincidence really well it was coincidence I, did, I wasn't intending to do that um, up That's probably the most challenging part of the game, really. It's not. There's no enemies to avoid or anything, is there? It's. It's. You've got a time limit, and you've got. Um, you can't go down, so you've got to plan your route to avoid having to go down the steps and avoid the bugs, of course. Five. Who'd have thunk it? Not me. The main generator room. Whoa. What's going on here? Uh -huh. Okay. Um. Yolo. One thing I haven't seen in this yet is in Colin the Cleaner, um, if you had a teleporter with another teleporter above it, it shot you up at yet another level. I don't think I've come across that yet. Ah! Where to go? Are oh, we done? We are oh, done. I don't know why that one didn't work must have hit one of the bugs but it looks like that's going to be it because I'm going to just all I've got is to wait for the time to run out now um, luckily it wasn't that long left and when you're not moving it ticks down a lot quicker um, let's see I've got good news for you by the way um, when you die there is music it's not um, what was it in the last one Chariots of Fire was it I can't remember it's not that um, but you still can't skip it <laughs> So I'm going to let you enjoy that before I uh, close up the video. Nearly there. At least that effect is pretty cool I think. Run out of time. Still didn't qualify for the high score table. Is the tune? A 
no idea what that tune is. <laughs> and we get this little outro. And there we go, back to the beginning again. So, uh, yeah. Um, that's it, really. Ralph on Alpha 2. Uh, interesting piece of uh, history, I think. Especially if you liked playing Colin the Cleaner back in the day. Um, yeah, I hope you liked it. If, if you want to play it and you can't get hold of the files, send me a comment and I'll see what I can do because I have got a snapshot that works on the next. So you can always try that one. And I'll leave it there. Cheers.